Hi, this is a message for uh, Salomon Khan and actually anyone listening especially I hope somebody important because I'm just flabbergasted by the pure awesomeness that this person can express I mean not only he gets four degrees from MIT, Harvard, and all the rest, and then decides to leave his old job as a, a financial advisor for a hedge fund analyst or something, to devote his entire life to provide free and open education to anybody in the world. And he does that splendidly. No, that's not enough. Uh, he has to create an entire academy, the Khan Academy, to provide free education for everybody and gets all the most awesome people on his team to work for making the world a better place. Not just that, he anything you can imagine that is good and that it's worth doing, he has done it. Um, I, I, I honestly don't know what else to say. I mean, I, I was thinking, hey, wouldn't it be cool if it started, you know, expanding the system to include uh, lessons uh, from other people as well, like art, music, maybe those kind of things that it's not really into, done. Well, I said, okay, how about, I don't know, implementing a system that provides a more um, kind of feedback mechanism to the exercises, such as machine learning algorithms, done. Say, okay, how about, I don't know, Q&A sessions with talking, I mean, there is Stanford, Stanford University doing very cool things, uh, like the artificial intelligence class, the machine learning class, and those things, and said, like Salman Khan and the Khan Academy, why don't we put them together and do something? And what do you know? A couple of weeks ago, Google Hangout with the, the guys from Stanford, uh, Sebastian Thrun and uh, uh, Peter Norwick, and all the other students uh, collecting it, and he's so humble in in the middle of all this still remain still remains humble, funny, entertaining, informative, precise, engaging in the way he teaches. I mean, it's just unbelievable. And and now, huh, ask me anything on Reddit. What do you know? So, posted this about twenty-two hours ago. Already uh, two hundred, six hundred comments or whatever, and he of course gave a reply to most of them and then he says, oh, you know what, I'm gonna do a video response and then he just uploaded a video response of 40 minutes so, so if you're watching this and you are a policymaker or somebody from the Nobel Committee in Sweden hey, I've got an idea who you should give the next Nobel Peace Prize to not some asshole who starts wars and kills hundreds of thousands of people, maybe this guy would be a better choice. Peace.